we're at Bucky's. This is where it all started whenever we hit our first road trip. This is a long overdue trip back to Houston. Had to make the uh, official stop at Bucky's along the way. Let's grab some snacks and get back on the road. You can get the hippo taco, which is the bacon, beans, and eggs. Or you can get the rhino, which is the sausage, beans, and eggs. Or you can get the beast burrito. Let's see how heavy this thing is. Hold on. Pretty beastie. I mean, it's got some girth. Or you can get, oh, it's private, you know? Of course I know you guys. Oh, yeah. Hey. You're about to be on the vlog now. We bought, I've bought so much stuff from your guys' shop. Nice. Well, yeah. thank you. Right now I'm not in. All good. All good. Yeah. All good. Thank you. Nice to meet you. They don't have like a barista bar for coffee. They got the deli and the bakery. Why would they not have a coffee shop? I got you a super coffee. I got sugar in it. I drink lattes with no sugar. He just said he wanted a latte. He wanted zero added sugar. He wanted 10 grams of protein and he wants four shots of coffee, which I think is like 60. 60 times four is 240. You're barely missing a shot. There's flavors over there. There's hella flavors. All right, show me the flavors. Yeah, come on. Somebody put me in touch with the Bucky's marketing team. This no Gatorade thing here is insane. Look, it's bold and smooth, zero added sugar, dairy-free, 250 milligrams. You gotta try it. 10 calories, and they're two that's you. Dairy-free, which is what I want. That's why I get oat milk, because I don't want milk. Yeah. 250 milligrams of caffeine, which is good. No no flavor, it's just black. Yep. It's what I like, zero sugar, 10 calories. He's gonna want these too. Oh yeah, he loves- Scott some... can't go without having <laughs> dilly bites. Yeah, he loves a good <laughs> dilly bite. <laughs> Put it in reverse on a one way. Put it in reverse, Terry. Put it in reverse, Manny. <laughs> Put it in reverse, Manny. Yo, we out here in the big H. Manny, you're driving sloppy yeah, you're as You're back hell. up. You, you failed the part of the driving test where you have to drive in reverse. We're picking up my boy Rodney. Rodney's been on the episode. He's actually on the Houston episode before, yeah. but he's not even from Houston. But he happens to be in Houston every time we're here because he's right-hand man to rap a lot, but he also films for Finesse. It's finesse two times. Hey! hey. What's up, big dog? This is my brother right here. Like being my wedding type brother, up, brother? if I ever get married. <laughs> <laughs> hey, actually I got a gift for Scotty Woe. Really? Might as well do it right now yeah, while yeah, the camera's rolling. Come on. I haven't come, I haven't come to Scotty's birthday for two years now. Yeah. You know, this is like a one of a kind gift. Okay. Uh, it's really for the shop. All right, it's cool. Let's see it too, Larry. Oh, you got it? You got it? <laughs> it's, been, it's been collecting dust. So I'm about to, Yo! I'm about to give it to oh, him. Oh, wow. Give it to y'all. Wow. <laughs> His reaction, look as good. Wow. <laughs> you want to know what's He's got it. You told me about this. Bro, you told me about this so many times. Long story short, back in the day, us three used to run a streetwear slash resale store called Collective Statics. We ran it, we put our heart into it. We didn't own it, but we treated it like we owned it. Mm -hmm. And we had every major rapper, artist, producer, you name it, walk through those doors because we were the only resale streetwear store in Austin, period, in the heart of 6th Street, around all the bars and clubs. And we bought this Labit, and when people came through the shop to shop with us, they would sign the lab it. I bug him about this shit all the time. He'd say he didn't know where it was, had no idea, and he found it, and here it is. Look, you got the fucking chef, bro. Raekwon. So many, 40 ounce, look at 40 ounce bands. 40 ounce bands. Bro, big crit. Dog, this is nuts, bro. This is, oh, Shannara Butler. Yo, Pimp C's fucking wife. UGK right here. Yo Gotti. UG, UGK for life, Yo Gotti. This is crazy. Drama, Drama, boy. Drama boys big on Sean, here. Big Sean at? Is it right here. My girl, Lil Debbie. Yeah, Shout out to my girl, Lil Debbie. Debbie. Crazy. Run it. Uh, uh, Killer Cali on. Oh, look, two chains. Boy. Two look chains. Look at this one. Schoolboy Q. Schoolboy Q. Lil Flip. Willie D. Ghetto Boys. R.I.P. DJ Screw. And the drew a fucking oh, screw. Oh, Chief Key. Chief Key. Three hundred. Three hundred. Iraq. What is that? Oh, it's the little fucking glow gang eyes. Oh my god. So many people on here. Big Jenkins. Stay blessed. Big Sean, that's it. Bro. Big Sean. Big Sean. Stay blessed. Dog. This we got is pictures crazy, and videos of everybody signing. Bro. You know what I mean? Johnny Dangs. And we're in Houston going to Johnny Dangs to go get another 
ring, and I believe the store is which way? That way. That way. <laughs> <laughs> this is cool, bro. We're back. Back where it all started. This is the first time we left Dallas, did a little travel episode. Before we even knew what we were really doing with this YouTube, we took a trip down here to Houston. We were here for the Home Film pop-up. And we oh, yeah. were here for a pop-up with our brother Drew for Home Film oh. LA. And that kind of spurred off everything that you guys have watched us go through the last couple years. When we started the Texas tour, we realized we hit every city, every major city in Texas except for Houston. So we've been overdue for a trip to come back here, do a little shopping, but it was only right that we started off back where it all started. Let's go. Doing, huh? You got a appointment? Yeah. No? Nah. Just walk in? Okay. Yeah, fine with me. <laughs> Take care of it. Look, I got this last time I was here. Yes, sir. Do you have anything like that? Green You want to double it up? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, you can stack it. Like, put one, one finger. Put... <laughs> Damn, Boy, good, the one you're super shining right now. Is this only place for the rings? I don't know. Like, do I want something different? Last time we were here, we were here forever just staring yeah. at diamonds. Literally just staring at diamonds. And I feel like that's what we're going to be doing for like an hour and a half. Just staring at diamonds. Remember last time we were here and everybody was ready to like move on and go upstairs and do other stuff and I was just stuck down here just in a world of just trying to figure out my life through jewelry. I did the ring, I did the bracelet, I got the chains, I got the earrings, like there's not really much else to do right now. So I'm gonna I'm keep prospecting and uh, we'll see what happens. Yeah, this guy's going crazy right now. This is 11.5. <laughs> Diamond boy. Yeah, you heard him. <laughs> I like this one too. And you could dip this one yellow? Yes, sir. Five minutes. Five minutes. Keep it plain and just do a pinky there. Hear me out real quick. So all of our watches are factory watches. There's factory diamonds. My day date has factory baguettes. But I said sometimes you just want to be ignorant. And I was like 10K for ignorant watch. Isn't that crazy? Feels good. <laughs> <laughs> Bust down, baby. Diamond boys. <laughs> I don't know what to do, Larry. Listen, you've gotten my take. You, even you say you get it. Yeah. That's, that's just a... It's just, it, it's... merely it, an expert opinion. Yeah, I, okay. He says merely an expert opinion, but it is an expert opinion. Because you're playing a, with the other options, you're playing a dangerous game over here. If, if I were you being in business, diamond business in particular for yes. 42 years, yes. I would go with it. Okay. You heard, you heard man. So I want something chill. I don't want to go as thick as this one. I think I'm just gonna do it. Yeah, on which one? On what? A donut. I got a donut too. Yeah, just donut with me, bro. I like I'm doing one. it. I like yeah, let me dip it yellow. Yeah. All right, you heard it. I really like this one, to be honest. Like, it just looks nice on your hand. But should I get it in gold? What it, cause this is gold, right? Oh, yeah, dip it yeah. in gold. I just, he's dipping my one back there right now. In the words of Larry, I'll buy it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I like that one too. Boom. Ooh, it's got look. It's got look at it. Diamond boy. You heard that? Diamond boys. Oh yeah. Hard. Perfect. Ooh. See, looks tight. It does. Y'all yes, doing alright? What's up, guys? Early boys. What's going on, man? Early bird boys <laughs> in the building. Let's go. Dallas to Houston, man. Yes, so, what did y'all get? Y'all got something too? Yeah. Oh my God, dude. Where's yours? I don't know. He already got here. He already killed it. He's already killed it. Yeah, I shot him already. Bro, yeah, 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 yeah. big ass stones. Hey, yeah. who who'd y'all work with? Him right here? Of course. Okay, good, good. Y'all good. Good. took care. Yeah, hey, good. took care of him. Yeah. All right, cause they gonna tell me upstairs. Are you guys already open upstairs? Yeah. Come on, come on, let's go for a little bit, man. Two days ago, I said, Houston, what's up? Drop some names of the best stores in Houston to go check out. Everybody. Everybody said Houston Closet and a couple other places, which we'll talk about when we get to those places. But the number one place number was one. Houston Closet. Yeah. So we already knew that and we're already connected. But yeah. We back again to check out some stuff. So. Win in H Town. Look at how we got it. Like, oh, I got the full H Town now. Bro. <laughs> okay, these are cool. These are really cool and smart to do. Yeah, there's a company 
that sells light up boxes called GOTO mm. and they're plastic stackable boxes with LEDs for bare bricks. That's tight. I feel like I want that in the crib. They're like cacti's going out of business. Let's just take these. This is from the Seltzer's yeah. stand that would be at like a Walmart. Larry, you and Abe. Yo, there's accessories in this place. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, there's like you gotta break this down. Supreme chairs on top of the Supreme <laughs> ping pong table. Supreme, Supreme, Supreme. Like, there's a lot going on right now. It says do not sit. Like, anyone's just gonna climb up here oh, they and will. sit. They will. <laughs> So this, this is, like is the this section. is the base section, yeah. For sure. Yep, you saw that a bunch of threes. I still love this shoe. It's a great shoe. That is a great shoe. I got eBay dunks, chilling. Fucking Levi's, chilling. This still Bart's such a chilling. Bart. This is a crazy base selection. Nah, this base selection. I'm is not hard. even gonna front. Twos, chilling. All sorts of foams. This Easy the number one stones. dunk for women yeah, at enough. our store. I've gotten like three pink. texts this week about that. Yeah, the pink Paisley is probably a banger yep. too. Yep, we got those now. All Star Weekend poster in Charlotte. That Jordan we got that was all weird, and that's when they the, the trainer. That's when they did the first 85 as yeah. well. Released that weekend. Oh look, and the, the pack. The Colin Kaepernick. Oh wow. We had we had those at the store for a little bit. Yeah. Pretty cool. I remember that one, Joe. What is that? Texas. Texas. Size that. Nine and a half, F1 Texas White. That's Hot. tight. Ooh, Death Row. Death Row. There's some shit on here. Chad, I need this shoe, bro. I still need that. I don't have it. I was going through my shit and I forgot I even had the Medicom. This is a variety. It you is. You got Chunkies in here, Chaps is in here, Par is in here. What's this? Hyper Pink? I haven't even seen this. Yeah. That's bright. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know what shoe I don't forgive I Ian for not getting me? Can we leak this? I don't forgive Ian here. for not getting me the Amma for the MCA green. Or not the MCA green. I don't have that shoe The off white green. And he didn't get me the fucking CPF Grinch. Ooh. All three of those are the only shoes. The only shoes I want, too. How'd you not get a Grinch? Yeah. I got Larry one. <laughs> I didn't get one. <laughs> got the Ian table. Yeah, this is the Ian table. You know I have none of these, Scott? I have none of this stuff. Of the, of the fruity pack? Do you right? have one of them? Yeah, I have the sour apple. Oh, the green apple. Yeah. oh, I was just, just seeing if you had one that I got for you that I didn't get for myself. Well, that's your fault that you didn't get. You're in charge of the shoes. You, the, hear, the, you hear it? For yourself. You hear it? It's right here. You want it? Get it. No, I wanted the green one. A lot of stores do not have a good easy selection right now. This is damn near every fucking easy. In one size though, yeah. right? Look, size is available. Mm -hmm. So they have multiple sizes. So they just have all the, the easies right here with the multiple sizes while yeah. everything else, bays are together. Hmm, maybe they're by silhouette. So these are all the Jordan 1s. Those are all the dunks. Then you got all big sizes. Then you have all Yeezys. Mike, how much are these? I could do 2.1 each. Okay. It's just because it's, it's 2010. No, it's rare. It's super rare. That's what we saw. I've never seen this like so old. Do you, do you know what this uh, one's called? A store. Yeah, Wonder Wall. It's called the, yeah. the Wonder, Wonder Wall. Yeah. Damn, Scotty. I thought there was a different oh, name for that. I thought there was a different nah, name. Nah, nah, he got it right. The so, Cause Wonder Wall. This guy's a Cause so, machine. Me, the crazy thing is, is when we go down. to regular stores like this, they don't have OG stuff like that. Even like. If I'm not gonna say, is this the one that comes in the box? The yes, plus their yes, number. Yes. We ended up waiting in line. We got three each, and we sold two and gave one to James Whitney, the owner of Amon Manier. Oh, yeah yeah, 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 yeah. But it's like, oh, you don't come across you don't see four. Yo, yeah, you no, don't yeah, see nah. rap fucking Nas tees, yeah. nasty, nasty tees. Like. Those came straight from Ben's collection, too. He had it, because he, he's been collecting Supreme for a minute, too. So, so have I, but he yeah. was like 14, 15, 16. So he's got right. some of the, the Gucci tee, Gucci yeah. Man tees yeah, yeah, still yeah, in the bag sure. and stuff, too. You know? Is that a I Matt Gondek? Oh, uh, no, no, no. It's kind of like, it's kind of like a a custom, you know? Okay, it looks yeah. like Matt Gondek. But we do have a Matt Gondek in here. Wow, that's sick, bro. I've tried Disney. all the time to get his prints and they sell out so you fast. Can't get it. There's just so much space in here yeah. and you don't want the walls to look you barren. Fill it up. So, yeah. you know, like we that's why we can put like bare bricks and some of the other stuff in here, you Is know? This from the pop up you did here? Yes, yes. Did y'all ever get the BH tapes? Of yes, this? yes. Gone though. Yeah, so, do you need one? How much are they? I got I got like six in my personal collection. I got yeah. I got three signed, three non signed. Just let, just, just let me know. I'll work I'll work, I'll work a deal with you. Yeah, yeah I got we'll you. Get you get yeah, you yeah, I got yeah. you. All right, so we got some Air Yeezys, some Ooh. fucking SB Dunks, Arch. Supreme. You got the Palace Uggs too. Hey, okay. Palace Uggs are hard, bro. Hey, so so when I brought them in, the guys were like, Mike. 
like, is this, would this actually sell? And I'm like, bro, it sold out in like 10 seconds. Bro, I, I literally, yeah. I slept through it and then I woke up, I was like, nah, there's no way, it's, yeah. it's gotta be on there. Yeah. I go there, everything's gone. What do y'all, what do you think about them for real? You, you like them? Yeah, I've yeah, seen yeah. a couple of those, like, what do you guys think? And the fits that I've seen put together, it's like, I would do it. It's pretty hard, right? I would yeah. do it. In every shop we go to, the Supreme case, this is always my favorite. I'm not gonna lie, this is a pretty heavy. Yeah. This is a heavy case right now. Do you know how much this dog bone is up here? Man, whatever it is, man, I'm gonna show you this yeah. I think that one's mine. I might need this dog bone. I got you. Bro, bro. Dog bowl or bone? Bone. 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 That bone. Let me yeah, see. I need this yeah, it's bone. mine. I got you, bro. Yeah, I need that bone. 550. Yeah, because that's, that's with the drop, right? OG drop? The Kermit's from the OG Kermit drop, yes. right? Correct. Correct. Nasty. So the, the way that you can tell that it's real versus fake, yep. the very bottom of here, you have these little inserts inside the feet. Okay. Fake ones are always hollow. Really? Yes, and, I, and I've had two fake ones I've dealt with on Grilled, and then luckily they gave me my money back so you yeah. pay by PayPal, Right. but yeah, they were fake. I need to do this with my shit. Like, I just yeah. I just moved a couple things in my house, and I have the off-white Ikea cases. Oh, nice. I have two of them side by side, and now I'm just gonna take all my accessories and just fill them up in the crib. So let me tell you the back the backstory on this. Guy, so so, so on. It's, it's funny, a guy came- This is stolen. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> he told me how he did it too. So he went to H-E-B, two of them. He went in there, it was like kind of like looking around. He put it in his, he put it in the cart. In the cart? In the cart. And then self checkout and just. And just it? It dipped off with it and they didn't say nothing. To two locations. That's hard. Two yeah, locations. It's in great condition. Right? <laughs> really and then is. we also have the uh, the one from McDonald's they ripped off too. <laughs> Shout out to my boy Corey Shapiro. Oh, I've been been to, you know, yeah, I've yeah, known this yeah, man yeah. for a decade. And uh, congratulations on your store in Miami as well. We did an episode, Rodney shot the episode, and we put it on World Star back in 2011. And I watched that episode. Oh yeah, and I watched he that watched episode it. on World Star, and, and that's, that's how he made found, me go to collective us. status. Oh that's wow, how met them that's that how he met us. On World Star. World Star through Corey Shapiro. Yep. What a crazy story, <laughs> dude. <laughs> so back when y'all did that shot, what was like, what was some of the best brand, or like, what was some of the most popular brands at the time that y'all were selling out of there? Uh, BBC was probably the biggest yeah. brand, and, I, and Ice Cream had just ended. So like, they, they hadn't came back yet. They just right, right, had, right. Ice Cream just ended. So it was what? Crooks and Castles. Oh yeah, Crooks. Dope. Dope Couture. Pink Dolphin. I love Dope. I thought Pink Dope was Dolphin. bad. I, oh yeah, Pink Dolphin. Pink Dolphin. Dude, Pink what Castles. happened to Pink Dolphin? They still around? Rocksmith was really big back Rocksmith. then. That Black Dope. Scale. Yeah, Black, Black Scale. Scale. Oh yeah, Black Scale oh, Black was super hard. Oh, yeah, that rock was just killing. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. It was real edgy. Yeah. You know, it had like Our the upside down was probably, stuff. Yeah. It was probably like, BBC and, and Pink Dolphin. I'd say. Let's get this. Let's pay for this hat. We gotta hit these other stories. All right, let's do it. Got the N E R D hidden in Y. That's right. And then yeah, I needed a bone. He got the bone. Don't be a freaking. Bone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna actually clip it out. Yeah, you gonna let it chew it up? Take yeah, this home with me. <laughs> the the so Manila random. video was fire. Okay. I, I, yeah, I, I we fuck got with it. So coming out too, and we have the island video coming out too. Oh, the yeah, island video is gonna be coming out. I can't wait. And then hopefully we got a good one for Houston coming That's up right. next, man. That's hey, right. hey, hey, hey. And even though I'm not at 300K yet, we're at like 8.5K. We've only been doing this the last three months. Okay. Give us a follow too. The Cloud Today HTX. You hopefully y'all tag us. Subscribe, please. Please. <laughs> there you go. Hey, hey, hey. That's probably the best one I've actually yeah, ever heard. Oh, let's go. That was the best, one. Oh, one. Uh, was the best Larry, one. lead us out, Larry. You saw it here first. Tapped in here at the Houston Closet with the one and only Mike. It's been a pleasure. We on to the next spot. We out. We out. We interrupt this program for an important news announcement. What's up, guys? I just want to let y'all know that we just restocked our bubble tees and hats as well. They come in three different colorways. The blue bubble tee, the brown bubble tee, the green bubble tee, but also went ahead and restocked all the hats to match with each color. Link is in the description. Click the link, get these now before they're gone because I'm not restocking them again. Sneaker store number two, we're at Central Supply. This was the second most talked about one in the, the ask whenever I was telling everybody where it's huge. Go. I was about to say that it's gotta be because it's huge. <laughs> this place is massive and the setup is fire as fuck. Yeah, and I'm excited to check it out. So let's just jump right into it, guys. Rip before.
before we even get anywhere, I noticed this over here. Let me break it down what you got. You've got sneaker aging, you've got customization, sneaker cleaning, and restoration all in this boxed off glass here. Which we'll get and to. You, yeah, and you see they are, they're working. They're going in. I'm about to tell you, this is the most amount of essentials I've ever seen in my life. Oh, wow. Look, keep going. Keep going. Oh, they're going by colors. Scott, keep going. And then they go into the shorts. Keep going. Going. Just keep going. How? How is there still so much? Maybe because yeah. Houston doesn't have a big supply. I mean, Nordstrom's carries it now, yeah. but I don't know. It might be that big of a want or demand yeah. that it sells out at those places and you can get it secondary this, here. This is like one of the biggest sneakers I've ever been in. So the front half is resale, the back half is vintage, and it looks evenly split, about the same of, on both. Love this shoe. I oh, need to get this just regular. I didn't not, see the black one. I have the gray I've one. I've never seen I have the gray one. one. I have the all green. I have the, the Paris look alike done. Yeah. With the bullet did. holes, Scott. Yeah. Still, arguably, one of my most worn shoes. I love this shoe. You even got a little 19 in here. Yeah, I know. I was showing uh, Scott like a white one, too. Oh, there's a CPFM. Let me see if it's a size 9. It's 2005. 10 and a half. So. Scott. I grabbed this because it was a 9 I was going to get it for you. <laughs> what is it? It's a 10 and a half. Oh. This is tight though, 2005. I, I used to look these up on GOAT back in the day. There's another yeah, color. Yeah, I, I remember. I remember. They've done, they did two different colorways. Yeah. Would y'all wear the, the Delta Force? No. You know what? I would. I'm pretty sure I have some Delta Force. Yeah, you got these. I do, have, I, do have a, <laughs> I do have a Scorpion, thanks to Ian. What? Oh, are these the potato? Oh, okay. The Imran. <laughs> yeah, these are the Imran. I mean, they're cool. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Imran fried crab. Fried crabs. <laughs> we'll see what the names are. Fried crab. I guess they're all called fried crab. crabs. Over here. Bro, I haven't seen I've, I've this shoe in so long. I remember when they switched over oh, from the regular. Way? Bro, yeah. it's crazy. <laughs> this, it's just crazy how like shit like this used to sell for thousands. Back in the day, you could have got one pair of an Adidas NMD or two off-white the OG off-white uh, Air Max 90s. It was the same price back then. I got some else that's kind of cool. Now it's $100. Let's talk about this crazy vault they have over here. The setup for this is insane. Yeah, it's nuts in here. Um, let's take a look at some of the shoes, but from what I see, just the way that they laid it out, double-sided, or I guess four-sided. How do you feel about the Supreme Baskin they dropped? It's okay. That was the latest one. A lot I'm of people didn't like it. I'm a fan of these. I kind of, I feel like we should go back and get a Ramoa like this. Thing. The Air Bacon? How much, how much is that? 3,000. 3,000, though. Got the special box. A little Drew in it. No, they made a little Drew Monk. Skittles. Supreme accessories. Looking at Supreme accessories is just one of my favorite things to do. It's one of my biggest wastes of money, but I just love it. The Supreme LB slide. Oh. Dress slide. That's cool. That's really cool. So this is like design, little designer section. That's OG. I have these. These jackets that he did are so sick. So hard. Oh, it's the gallery jackets hard. Neighborhood. Neighborhood B loan. Ooh, what you don't normally see. Packs. Yeah, countdown packs. We talk about this all the time, how we never see packs in stores. Satins, igloos. You, guys see, how the, do you, you see how they're you see how they're gonna come back out with the uh, the bread yeah, satin? Yeah, and they're doing it. I don't know uh, they're like doing it women's or whatever. Though. It's a women's shoe. Yeah, that's fire. That pack. Where are we looking pack? at? Oh, the airship one. Yeah. My mom and you did a game royal airship. Yeah, yeah. That was the first airship that to was, drop. Yeah, yeah. When? Like, um, maybe last year. Okay, this is my first time seeing one. It's an Ami and a Hellcat. Version. Oh, I haven't seen. I that. haven't seen his version yet. Right next to a cool Kai. August last year. All right, let me send this shit to Kai. I'm gonna send this to Kai. Cause dolls. Oh, the Mission Mars. The little watch. Oh yeah, we learned about it at uh, Philippines. Yeah. Color pop with the world is super yeah. cool, bro. Oh, look up top. Larry, do you have the muted one? I'm very well mic. <laughs> I have five and two are gray and three are not so i don't but i feel like it's not that pose these are the ones i slept on ian when they came out on canary and i never got them because I, I forgot really and i was on the site and i got distracted i went back and yeah, I kinda want one. they were gone yeah those are hard i don't want one i just don't know how the app fits yeah these look like they're signed by the gang signed by travis several signed signatures by travis that's tight whole little cactus jack section they even got the very first uh, Travis Scott. Wow. The, the we one, had this at the, the store one. when we first opened. Yeah, I know. And then they even had that company that was making those whatevers. 
Yep. We have that one, remember? Yeah. These are the ones they printed over. Yeah, the, the on-campus sample. Yeah. Nuts. Bro, there's some heat in here, bro. Yeah. There's some bang. Ooh, a Tiffany Low. A nice Tiffany Low. Good, good condition, too. Yeah. Look at all these. Papa Bears. You know where my Tiffany Low is. Safari. I don't even know what that is. Ian was telling me there's a fish tank at Johnny Dang's, too. I didn't yeah, see it. It's a fish yeah. tank city. Houston is a fish tank city. Let's see how many other stores got fish tanks. How's it going? Pretty good. What's up? What's up? My name's Scotty. Scotty M. Nice to meet nice you. How you doing, know, Ian? Nice to meet Ian, you. Ian, Mariella, Larry. M. So my name is M, and this is my baby, Soul Supply. So these here came in. Um, somebody fixed them with whiteout. What? <laughs> you can see it. <laughs> we do a lot of regus, which is our other bread and butter soul swaps. So here are these mosquitoes, and we're going in and we're threading by hand. Wow. These are pretty neat project here. Run DMCs from back in, I don't know when, but he brought in a new uh, soul for me and I'm just kind of coming in, closing it up. And so this so. is a business within the business, right? Correct, so we've partnered with Central Supply to kind of offer the restoration, customization sure. piece of it. A lot of times people buy sneakers from next door, bring them over here and we can draw their dogs, we can draw. That's cool. Uh, Russo's Pizzeria, I mean, you name it, we do it, so. Everything that you pretty much need to keep your sneakers fresh, clean, restored. How long have you personally been doing this? Oh man, I think since I was like 13 or so. So we opened our first brick and mortar store here. So we're probably um, one of the first in Houston to do yep, right. all the services under one roof. Right. So, so but that's the most impressive part is when you say all the services because it takes different skills to do all of these restoration things right. that you've just broken down from right. you know, restitching the sole to fixing the yeah. paint. Those are two different skill sets to have. So right. the fact that you can do all of that is very, very Like impressive. all these machines, I'm looking out. <laughs> trying to out, like what each thing does. Like what does this thing do right here? So we actually have a cobbler and he's out for the day, but this one he uses to sand down the shoes. So a lot of times when the shoes come in, they need to be sand. This one here is a shoe shine. So we do get a lot of like red bottom, black, brown, so on and so forth. And he does a lot of his boot work on this thing, not so much for sneakers, but if we did need to fix something up, we would come here, do it, um, blues stuff like that. So yeah, pretty much can fix anything. Super cool. If you don't mind letting them know where to find you and your social media for your company. Our shop Instagram is Soul Supply Official. Mine is Money Ella. Yeah. <laughs> so it's money underscore Ella. So, um, but yeah, that's where you can find it. So beautiful. Cool, cool. Awesome. Thank you so Thank much you. for taking the time. All right, no problem, guys. You. Likewise, likewise, thanks for coming out. We appreciate it. All right, Central Supply was dope from the restoration to the glass cases. I'm really impressed right now with Houston. We're yeah. only at two stores now. I have like seven more on the list. I didn't know they came so hard here. I didn't know they come so hard. The yeah. layout's super clean. The quality of how they put everything together was great. The selection was cool. I saw a lot of OG shit in there. Right. A lot of collab stuff in there, like the LV slides was super fucking cool to me. Certain pieces that I've never even seen before in person, right. I actually saw in here. But not to mention, this store is probably the size of like, it's like the size of Urban. Bro, the store's Maybe huge. like, yeah. And like, that's huge. my whole key here is typically a, a store this big, it's hard to find as many grails yeah. and things like that. But this place is loaded with stuff. Yeah. I mean, the clothes, we couldn't even dig into that. They have racks and racks of vintage. Yeah. And then just the simple fact that even if your shoes are dirty, you want them cleaned up, whatever. Customize. Bring them to my girl M. M going to get you right. Literally. Customize, draw your dog on there, all of that. So from the restoration, knowing that they do soul swaps, all of that, one-stop shop, definitely a very cool spot in Houston. They got a lot of supply at Central Supply. A lot right. of supply <laughs> at right. Central Supply. Let's head to the next one. Sneaker store number three. We just pulled up the Sneaker Summit. Small mom and pop type shop. This is the type of stuff we love. I'm excited. I feel like easily gonna find some grails in here. I've peeped through the window a little bit. It's looking pretty positive Show so far. Show what's in the window real quick. Yeah. First ball. First it's, all the people, it's all the people that got beat up trying to steal stuff from here. Yeah. I mean, that's my dog right but here. This, this that's is my dog right yeah. here. Yes, sir. Sneaker Summit is arguably like the OG of the OGs yeah. in Houston. So yep. we gotta Let's check go. it out. What's up, doggy? What's up, brother? What's up? You good? You good? What's up, man? What's up, bro? What's good, G? Yes, sir. What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good?
What's up, man? It's boy Ralph G, Snicker Summit going down. We've been doing this 19 years. You already know the vibes. Store's been here for seven, so uh, take it away. Y'all got yeah, it, man. Whatever we didn't, you need, we let didn't me go know. back, bro. I've driven out here several different times to the events, cash out on a bunch of different stuff. He always takes care of me, lets me in, and I've actually never been to the store. He's been telling me to come through every time that we're in town, so we're here. Let's highlight it and let's check it out. Let's do it. See that story, Alma? Uh, uh, that was the first wait, thing. Wait, 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 wait. Straight up. Soriyama, babe. Oh wow! This is like my vibe though. When you got like a bunch of OG stuff packed in the one, just looking crazy. Oh, these just came out, and I never got mine. I paid for them, never received them. You should probably ask for my money back. I bought the whole collection. But you see, you got Travis all the way across mm -hmm. the top, as you should, being that this is his hometown. Off all the unions, unions across. You got some bangers in here. Off, off white. Some fifties, all my I need a new black. The pack. Oh, here we go. These are my favorite. I haven't worn mine yet, but I got Damn, I got all the colors. That's what I need them. is this. I have that one and the black, all black one. Yeah, I got both. This is this is just the only one. I look at the green and the blue every time. I'm Remember like, these? They were just sitting for like retail for the longest. Alma Air Force came out. Like oh wow! I bought yeah, I had, yeah, yeah, we store. had those. Yeah. 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 Premium goods. Yeah. Oh, the premium goods one. The Houston special right yeah, here. Nice, super and dope. The quality of this looks yeah, pretty. Yeah, with the little rope lace, which is yeah. I get props to the DIY people on social media for making this whole rope look. But check this out, both of them high and low. Wow, pretty cool. Supreme Blazers up top. Oh yeah, look, 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 look. Scott, Scott, don't, don't sleep on. Look right past. You look right past oh, Supreme Blazer. Wow. Just chill right there. That's not the best colorway. Best colorway. I'm just getting wow. this Supreme North. I'd be scared to color. try this on. It's too old to put on and wear. Yep. I feel like I, almost. Yeah. I'd soul swap or re glue it, then and then. Nah, wear I'd it. run it. I'd run it down first. You tripping, bro? <laughs> I'd run it down first. Why would you just go straight to it? Because it's let me run it down. 16 years old or something like that. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. This, <laughs> this is what I'm looking at. Yeah. Hard, bro. That's, yeah, that's so I actually okay, had, life? and I actually had the Lil Wayne Reeboks that were the same model, but it was a high top. Is this one too? That's the Pro yeah. Kit, yeah. That's, that's the, yeah. Oh. It's for sale Super too. Right? These are for sale? We have a few. Oh, Wait, I don't want to get one of these. Yeah. It's a nine and a half. And you got the white too. Ooh, yeah. Look at, hey, look at this toe. I'll take, look the, at this toe, I'll take the nine and a half in this one. Wow, sign. Carrie, you know where these are? <laughs> you know where these yeah. are? They're just back there somewhere. They've been around for so long, just chilling. That's a lot one, baby. Oh, okay. Original. There it is. Oh, man. I've never seen I've this never before. Seen you have? No. <laughs> no, I haven't. I, I mean, you're I in Houston, it. bro. Where else would you see it? Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> where else would you see it? Hold yeah. on, man. So What's this one, bad boy right here? This is cool as fuck, bro. Yeah, that's the fucking trail hard. Trail. On the back. What's the other one sound on the back trail also? I believe. Yeah. There you go. What size is that? It looks like 14. His size. I was about to say, it looks yeah, like his size. size. <laughs> it looks like his size. Sign. Sign. So, and so why did that have the text? Oh, yeah, why is this on here? Uh, this is a premium goods one. So y'all uh, got it yeah. directly. Got it. Yeah. Directly. Yeah. Crazy. So what all store, like... Premium only got that. Wooden box. No, it's six. Premium six. goods. Six. This is so That's nasty. Cool. With the Texas ties, crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was like Derek gave us to me. Oh my gosh. Yeah, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> That's like that giant puma, you know what I'm saying? This thing is huge, bro. What is it, 22? Yeah. This is crazy, bro. Yeah, we just have stuff hidden. Like, you gotta just. You gotta really look. look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you gotta really look. Like, yeah. like the Supreme Blazer. Yep. Like, yeah, you, you, we would've just kept going if you yeah. wouldn't really, like, look. Are these side by Jeezy? Yeah. <laughs> what was the one we saw at the auction? Uh, the USDA Air the Force USDA. One. Mm. Mm. Yeah. By the snowman himself. Look at it. Holy fuck. That's so tight. <sighs> That's crazy. Nah, That's so you know what's crazy is I feel like I feel like rappers don't just get like like it's the same rappers that get shoes now. Yeah, like I feel like they they don't just like hey here you get a little one off like it's like Travis all right run him here run him an entire line yeah we're going the dark tour oh shit I went what? to that I went to that too. I went to that too I went to that and it was Rihanna Ner N E R D and fucking Lupe Fiasco yeah. I went to that shit in 07 and then I went to prison right after did you I, and like, that, two weeks later I went to prison I went to that one and then I also went to before that they did a show at Reunion Arena in Dallas which has since been torn down but. 
uh, Kanye was doing the Mountain Dew fucking X Games tour, and they would do the X Games, and at the end of it, Kanye came out and he was testing out the glow suit for that tour. Yeah. But that was the year before that. That shit was, Why are and that was amazing. Down here, like amazing shit. Ones or something? Those are sneaker summit. Those are yours. Yeah. What? Yeah. You have your own suit. Pull it out. Talk to me real quick. What's going on here? What year? What are we doing? Man, this was before me. But was this like All Star? Yeah. Yeah, All Star. Yeah, it was All Star. Yeah. And he was there. Terry Kennedy. Terry Kennedy. Yeah. 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 yeah TK. Yeah. TK. This one was a TK. I think that's a Stevie. And these are all num numbered, I'm assuming. Yeah. So 108. Yeah, Stevie Williams. 97. That's what it was. All Star. Fuck yeah, dude. Tight. These ruled the world for a they while, just, bro. They released yeah, them. and Radii. Bro. This is so cool. That's and enough I for like sale. How they're bringing no. back. Yeah, he said never. Roasters <laughs> and stuff now too. So I like that. Yeah, I've been copying. So like, I like how they did. They brought these back, but they kind of changed the color. Yeah. yeah. Blocking here and there. I saw. I bought all three of them. The green, purple, and the blue. Yeah. yeah. I never realized that there was an OG one, but I'm like, clearly this is yeah. not the. Mm -hmm. Oh, you haven't seen? The, you didn't know there's an OG clot? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. mm -hmm. Not. A, I was never an Air Max yeah. guy, so that was stuff oh, that I wasn't paying attention yeah. to. We haven't even gotten into the story. Yet. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was just on the front. the front door. I just, I didn't realize. I didn't know that. that there was an, yeah. that there was an OG iteration. The didn't even have, you know what I mean? OG didn't yeah. have it. And this like, is for sale or no? No. That was, at one point it was, yeah. he was going to take it off. And like the heel tabs orange, this one's red. Like they reversed it. Yeah, they reversed it. Sense, yeah. Autograph, shell toes. Golly. What? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's cool as fuck. Yeah. That's super tight. Wow, bro. Now that's... we're in the store. Yeah, I still have mine. I haven't won I it yet. I sold mine and I regret it. Yeah, I still have mine. I haven't won it yet. A little Very chrome cool. hearts. 34 length, yeah. All of them are. Is everything dead stock or? or yeah, I was gonna ask that too. It's all DS, everything? Okay. They got all the bear bricks, thousand oh, percent. Yo, you just over here pulling out chrome sweats. Yes. Yeah, what, 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 what are you doing? Just look in, look in. Whole lot of Supreme, Travis, yeah. Warren Lotus. A lot of essentials, uh, Stone Island, it just never ahead. ends. Go There's there. a lot of cool Rocky. stuff in here. Yeah. Uh, nice shot. Somebody that. brought that. Oh. Yeah, everything in here is consigned. I don't have this one, though. Uh, this is another shirt I regret not getting. Human made pillow. I'm just holding on to it until the time comes. 180. The fucking sled. The one that we have at our store, but at uh, the Seeker Summit convention. Ah. When I was here. How did I not know this shoe even came out? What shoe? I'm on your airship. Oh, yeah. I don't that even know it existed. I looked it up. It was August 2022. Never knew it existed. Yeah, really? It's because it only dropped there. It only dropped at Alma. Yeah. It's just so much shit I gotta keep up with now. All these damn shoes coming out. These off white, the ones that came out the yeah, Jordan with the fives. fives. I have like three pairs of these for, I don't, don't know why, in, in my size. So I just started cutting them into shorts. And then I okay, no. And I cut them so bad. It's They're like just like a, It's just like a jagged edge. Like I need someone to fix them. But they would be tied as shorts. Yo, what? Hey. Hey, he got a camera now too. You better watch out. Shooters. He's shooting now, you know what I mean? Just <laughs> this is a shoe that I would repeatedly buy over and over and over again. I'm so mad about this shoe because it sat and I was like, I'm not gonna get this. This is today. literally yeah. one of my favorite shoes I that I own that I wear a lot. That's a, that's one that I still I got, need. I got that one on ice. I have Top it and three. I wear it, but I got it's it on like, ice. Uh, this is one of those ones whenever I whenever I tell the story of having a shoe and then selling it and then regretting it. Uh, this is I had two pairs of these. This is one my favorite. I got for retail. Mine was, it's not that big of a deal, but a pair that I got rid of is the homage to home. Oh, yeah. And it's like just for the sake of See, collection, I just I got lucky. Yeah, I bought I found a guy that had this pair, a bread toe, and uh, Nigel Sylvester. All and I got 13, all, all of them in my yeah. size, and I was like, this is so cool. Original bomb. Cars. Look, <laughs> it's so look tight. That's for y'all. That's trail. That's trail. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna gift that to y'all. No, no, put that in your no, office. Huge. I know y'all got a lot of. No, lot of we got, got a lot of shit. I got yeah. a lot of keeps. Even if you so. didn't request that, that's exactly where. No, it no, yeah. yeah. No, no, no. Thank you, love, bro, love. Ah. So enjoy it. Show what it is. Yeah. Let's get it. <laughs> oh, free the pimp. Rest in peace. So from Sneaker Summit to you guys. Man. Beautiful man. Crazy. It's been a long time coming. Sneaker Summit has been something I've been going to for years. It's been an honor to be at this store. This store is legendary. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you that right now. And there's a lot of cool things that I saw and learned about today. One being these right here. 
And man, I just want to say thank you for everything. I appreciate the hospitality. The love is real. This is the type of stuff that Ian, Larry, and I love to walk into. Mm-hmm. Right when we walked in, I already knew what time it was. Yeah. It's, yeah. When we yeah. can, when you we can see through the window. When you yeah, walk into the store, you automatically know, is this my vibe or is this not my vibe? Yeah. And this is definitely our vibe. And so, man, I truly appreciate it. Thank you at the bottom of my heart. We'll take care of these. I promise you from one text. Hey, I made it to another. Yeah, I want them in the office. I want them in the office. <laughs> <laughs> of course, the office. Going for sure. Sure. Yeah. I'll appreciate letting them know where to find you as far as like streetwise, social media, and your social as well. So our Instagram is going to be at Sneaker Summit. That's going to be across all social media platforms. Uh, our address is 3814 South Shepherd Drive. And then you can hit me up at, at Ralph G. Knows. My dog. Again, love, thank bro. you so much. Love, this love, so love, cool. love. Yeah, like, Original love. box. Too. Love. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the cool part. Original fucking box. Just got to the Airbnb and uh, it's three stories. We are starving. We haven't ate since we had our little snacks at, at Bucky's at, at Bucky's 10 o'clock in the morning. At, yeah, so I'm hungry. Why are you moving so quickly? I found a good room. Oh, yeah, you're right. The good stuff's always up top. Look, I'm gonna put Scotty over here. Oh my god! <laughs> it's a washer. Look! <laughs> you gotta help me, bro. <laughs> so. Whenever we get Airbnbs, yeah. I run into there first while everyone's busy doing other shit and I always try to get the best room first. So, welcome to my room. I do like the shades of green, it's nice. It's the tub. And the green here. Be careful with the banisters. Okay. I'm launching the drone off this bitch. Are you? Speaking of, <laughs> someone beat me to it. Oh shit, they're launching drone skis, what up? Should I go dog fight here? You should. What's Manny doing in this video game? <laughs> Manny. Really? He's in this video game. And he's in it? <laughs> you just beat him up. Look, that's oh, Manny. Squat. <laughs> well, you gotta do that move too. <laughs> Can't do that in real life though. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I can't wait to see that. I'm dead. I don't know what's going That's the E Honda. Oh, I just made Andy go outside and do it because that's the guy he was playing. Man, let's see this. <laughs> Are you out of your mind? Yes. We're at Underground Hall, and basically you go like two flights downstairs, and there's about four different restaurants to choose from. So we're gonna order from probably all of them and taste test some stuff. So I'm already looking at a lot of things I like. I saw their IG, nice buns for bun slut. Fire. I'm looking over here at Walker though. Crispy curly fries, jalapeno bites, chicken and green dumplings, like. First plates are up. We've got some media tacos here from Los Primos. They look amazing. You see they've got the cheese covered all on you there. You know what this is called, Larry? It's a consume. And that's the broth that they like cook they, all the- That they cook the meat in. Yeah. All right, dig in. Oh yeah, that looks good. Very savory, flavorful. The tortilla or whatever is crispy. So it's not soggy or anything like that. I'll give it an eight out of 10. An eight out of 10. I'm gonna first hit with a little lime. I'm going straight into the consomme. Okay, so first off the rip, I can really taste the aromatics. An aroma is a smell, <laughs> not a taste. <laughs> you can't eat an aroma. Yeah, take my word and then butcher it. When chat GPT goes wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you get burrito tacos that are too soggy. This is not one of those. You have a little crisp so you could dip it. It's delicious. What makes this incredible is the crunchiness of the shell. Normally, like they said, these things can come out a lot more soggy, but these are super, super crispy, and it just gives the perfect balance of like the meat, you can go right through it, but the shell, you gotta crunch through a little bit. Incredible combination. 
nine out of ten on media tacos for me. How are the uh, aromatics that were coming off before you I, took a bite? I taste it. <laughs> but with the cheese and the crunch, to the brisket, I like the, the brisket was the the choice. soft. Tastes good, bro. I give it a uh, 8.5. Like, here's the key. The fact that the shell has, like, come apart on this side, and the cheese is holding it together like glue. At Taco Bell, all of the contents of this thing would have fallen all in your lap, but this thing is literally glued together with cheese. We're coming in hot, Scotty. I got it. This is the Birria pizza. That's hot. I want to try this one though. I barely touched it. It's like a, it's a good pizza. Very thin, thin crust. Very cheesy, very on top. I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty simple. What I'm a fan of, what do you like? Is this garlic sauce that's on here. We really? used to just regular tomato paste or tomato sauce. There's a garlic sauce on here. And there's a science when it comes to the thin piece. It can't be too crunchy. You still gotta have a little give in the dough and then not just crunch all the way through. Just got give in the dough and the garlic sauce sets it off. It's fire. It's always about the sauce and whatever they're doing, they're making this sauce. This isn't you no know, out of the jar piece of sauce over here. Bun slice. It's really the reason why I wanted to come here. And then little Christian told me there's a bunch of other places, so it was a win-win for me because I was gonna get bun slip, and then we can try other things. So I went ahead and got the slutty melt, with extra slut sauce, so it's super slutty. It is moist and ready for biting. Bite. I'll give you a bite. I don't know how I got the nest and get no bun slut. Sometimes you go home empty-handed, but I think no. he's gonna share his slut with you. Oh, he passed the slut over. Thanks, Larry. Yo, that's a real boy passing the one over when he's done. Mm. I mean. Okay, that was a good ass burger. Nothing crazy about the toast, regular toast. I like that it's soft, not super crunchy. Again, I think sometimes with the smash burger, it's other ingredients, not just the burger meat. This one's just a basic smash burger. I was a little say that the slutty sauce is saving them a little bit on this. When you compare this to Trill? Rocket Burger, can't, nothing. Rocket Burger is a shit. Amazing. But yes. even a troll burger is better. Better. Listen. You know why? It's the bread. Do you not remember that Andy told us on camera that he searched everywhere for the right bun? Potato, potato and bun. He found out. the bun and he scienced it, and that's what makes a sandwich. Yep. Don't get me wrong. This is not like a fast food one. No, I would take the, the smash burger and Bordecai. This is delicious. Ooh, that was the good. sauce is good, but this is just almost in and out to me. What is that? These are the jalapeno poppers, and those are brisket egg rolls. I want one. Oh. It's like a crab rangoon, but like a Mexican version. Yeah. Substitute crab for jalapenos. The same thing as a crab rangoon. It's good. It's really good. The batter on the bread, you can taste it's not like Jack in the Box where the cheese sticks taste like the curly fries and the you, curly fries taste like the egg rolls. You can tell it was it was uh, fried in really, really clean oil. You get what I'm saying? From I know that record, exactly. So that's just, everything just tastes the same. No, this is so clean, it's all the flavors of the item. What is that? The slutty fries. Oh, all right, wild. so, really? thank you. Not every day do you taste the wrap from the, an egg roll with brisket inside of it. I was gonna say it was with, mid. With duck sauce. Oh, it was definitely a cool taste combo. Oh, this you know is what I'm saying? Like, it says slutty fries, but I feel like this is a whole burger on fries. It is. Like, I don't know what to do. There is a burger in there? Yeah, but no oh, bun. wow, no bun. Yo, this is a little slut. <laughs> Hidden. She's throwing it back right now. She's throwing it back hard. All right, so what is this again? Brisket curly fries. It's like a sweet duck sauce on it. It's like sweet meat. I will say I wasn't expecting it to be so sweet, but Larry says it may have duck sauce on it. He's joking. However, uh, it's whatever this like extra sauce is that's making it very sweet. Nice curly fry, but the fried egg really set it off for me. This is fire, good. Um, I also like the slut fries, but I prefer the brisket fries over the slutty fries. All right, man, we're good. Mikey, grab some food, man. We have stumbled at Croppon, a Tres Leches place, but they're all themed pieces. So Six. she said the Fruity Pebbles is her favorite. Ooh, Nutella's probably nice. They have Reese's, I'm allergic to Nutella, <laughs> strawberry, caramel, mocha, red velvet, coffee, a bunch of different ones. So 
Fruity Pebbles, what else? Uh, Reese's. Reese's, what else? I was gonna say the red velvet. Classic red velvet would be nice, right? All right, we'll do one Fruity Pebble, one Reese's, and one red velvet. Get you a spoon. I'm full. <laughs> AF. Oh, is it soaked? Straight down? Yeah, it looks dry. I don't like it. You gotta... Oh. That's gonna be my only stickler is if it's not soft and it's a dry, so, a dry that's legend. Amazing. Is it? Yeah, oh, you have Reese's chocolate. Oh, no. Reese's oh. chocolate's on the bottom. A little, like a hard little chocolate. It's cold. Larry thought it may be moist or maybe dry. It is not. It's about as moist as possible. You have chocolate chips in the bottom, like Scott was saying. You got a little bit of like the little peanut dust on top. Phenomenal. Hey, get Rodney on camera. He has never spoken on camera. It's good. What, what is that, peanut butter? <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Wow, it's good. Just so soft. <laughs> You're gonna melt that? Yeah, what? there you go. Oh my gosh. Oh! Oh, what was that move? <laughs> Damn. I wasn't gonna spill it. You, you milked a cow with your mouth. A <laughs> cow oh, under. Yeah. You're like a baby goat. <laughs> <laughs> that's better than the that first one. So good. That's better than the first one. It is. Fruity Pebbles is better than Reese's. Yeah, for yes. sure. Okay, you guys know I'm a huge Reese's connoisseur, but I would easily take a regular Tres Leches cake this is over closer that. to the regular. But with a little twist. Come on, Rod. Yep. Right. Yep. Give me a little Christian. She said that's their number one. I believe it. Tastes like the cereal milk you have after you eat. Yeah, like the bread's already got the sweet taste like the cereal. Then it's you like, got the cereal in there. Yeah. Tastes like cereal milk uh, vape juice. You ever smoked that? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. That's exactly what it tastes like. Yeah, it tastes like the vape juice. That's exactly what it tastes like. I love drinking vape juice sometimes. <laughs> red velvet, I've never been a fan yeah, of. Yeah, I, I just, I don't see I'm not a red velvet guy. Oh, there's like a pool of liquid juice down the bottom. Blood. I want some of the pink. Okay. <laughs> I'll take a hey. scoop of the pink. Yo, you're not gonna like that. The, the red velvet? Oh, it's so up. mid. Oh, it, it, you ever had a mid velvet cake? It doesn't even feel soft. Yeah. Uh, aftertaste is kind of mid. I'll give yeah. it a 7 out of 10. This one's not horrible. Oh, it's not horrible. Yeah, it's the it worst. Is. <laughs> yeah, there's no it taste. Is the worst. It is the worst. Fruity okay. Pebbles? Yeah. Reese's. Reese's, hands up. Fruity <laughs> Pebbles? Uh, Reese's. <laughs> bro, I can't move. Why do I have to pick a house with like eight sets of stairs? That's what I'm saying, bro. It's four stories. Why do you think about like, all the eating and then having to climb them? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> Yeah, he just gave away the game. Yeah, he gave it away. He could have won. I could have? Yes. Where? Yeah. Where would I have gone? Stop right giving him hints, You had three and then... <laughs> stop helping him. I didn't even see that. Oopsies. <laughs> oh my god, that was close. This game is stupid as hell. Connect four, baby. Oh, oh, that's three. Bro, these are the same. Boom. Oh, I didn't see that one. <laughs> day one in Houston is done. It's been a hell of a day. Yes, I'm exhausted, and we just got stuffed at the underground hall. Ate a little bit too much. <laughs> God, bro. So funny. You said, and we got stuffed at the underground hall. <laughs> we hit a lot of stores today. Yeah, I feel we like did a this lot might today, be a record. Yeah. All the way from a huge store that was like an old Pac Sun yeah, or yeah. something, all the way down to Sneaker Summit, which just has all the grails, all the OG that we stuff. love to History. dig for. I've seen, History. I've seen Sneaker Summit on. Tons and tons and tons of vlogs yeah. on other stuff yeah. like growing up. OG. Yeah. So I was excited to see Ralph's that. Ralph's the homie, man. Yeah, Known for a very long time since status days. Me and Larry used to run six shoot with Rodney as well. 
Uh, so it was, a, it was a cool thing to circle back around and finally get to like pay tribute to the yeah, store exactly. and like you know see a couple things. The young Jeezy was crazy. Mm-hmm. He had his own sneaker. The gift. Got the gift. The Bumby. The gift. A lot of different things and, and important people have walked past through that store before. So it's cool to be a part of that now. For sure. Trust later. <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> 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 I'm about to pass out. P.S. You know you seen it here first. Any questions? You could buy it all at the private selection. P.S. You know you seen it here first. Any questions? You could put it on at the private selection. P.S. You know you seen it here first. Any questions? You could buy it all at the private selection. P.S. You know you seen it here first. Any questions? Go sneaker shopping at the private selection.